Hi, I'm Chef Lynn, and this is a Flavor Secrets Tip and Technique. Today what we're talking about is how to roast a pepper. If you like roasted peppers, this is a great thing to know because you'll save a lot of money. Um, canned or jarred roasted peppers are really expensive and it's very simple and easy to do at home. All you need is a grill. Now as you can see we're grilling this inside in the Flavor Secrets kitchen so if you do that make sure you turn on your ventilation fan because they can get a little bit smoky. All you have to do is to throw this right on the grill. No oil, no nothing. Just put the raw pepper right on the grill. As you can see, I don't even bother to take off the little paper things on the outside because the skin will come off as we do this technique. And then all you have to do is turn it around on the grill until it gets black. So really, anybody can do this. Basically, all you have to do is burn it. You can do it. Okay, so make sure it gets black all over and this takes maybe about 20 minutes for a pepper to fully cook. Cook. Make sure it's black on the bottom and even stand it on its head. You know it's getting done when it starts to collapse like this and when it starts to steam. You know it's getting done. When it's finished, now I have another one over here that's cool that I'll use so I'll just turn the grill off and leave this sitting here. When it's finished it will also start to kind of steam and then you know it's done. Okay, so when it's finished, <laughs> I think that was the third time I said that, wasn't it? Anyway, when it's finished, all you do is stick it in a paper bag and let it cool. I've actually doubled this paper bag because the, the moisture from the pepper will work through the bag and it'll kind of fall apart. So there's my pepper that's just cooled enough to handle. And now what I want to do is first take the seeds out by pushing right here. This, most of the seeds will come right out with the end. Okay, and then I just want to peel off that black skin. And what you have underneath is a really beautiful tasting red pepper flesh that tastes just slightly smoky. Now the one thing some people do that's a bit of a mistake is they run it under cold or not even cold, they run it under running water. What you do if you do that is you wash away all the beautiful smoky flavor. So don't do that. You can, if your fingers get kind of icky like mine have, you can dip your fingers in water, but don't put the pepper itself in water. Because the reason we're doing this is to get that really beautiful smoky taste and we don't want to wash it away. Okay, so there's one piece. Here's another. I like to have some water available because I like to keep my fingers clean. You can also use the back of your knife to scrape off that black if you want to. Here's another piece and here's another piece. Now smoked peppers are called for in lots of recipes. They're also really delicious just eaten as a side by themselves. And once you prepare them, you can keep them about three days before they'll go bad. What I like to do is to, let me just finish this and push these out of the way. What I like to do, again, I'm using the back of my knife to scrape so that I don't dull it. Then I don't have to sharpen it quite as often. What I like to do is to take these strips and usually when I roast peppers, I'll roast different colors together. So I'll roast red and green and yellow and orange or, or whatever I have. And then I like to cut them into julienne strips like this. I'm making them nice and thin, little strips. And then imagine these all piled together as different colors. It's really pretty. And then I just sprinkle a little bit of olive oil over the peppers. In fact, it can even be a flavored olive oil. That's really good, like lemon or tangerine or lime, if you have that. I sprinkle some salt and pepper on these, put them in the refrigerator, and let them marinate overnight. And you have a really beautiful side dish and or garnish. So there's your roasted pepper. I'm Chef Lynn, and this is the Flavor Secrets Kitchen. Bon appetit. Enjoy.